to uh, Monarch Park si Part 6. Okay, so without further ado, we're going to get on with it. We are going to try and tackle the... If you remember from last time, it's been a while, but if you remember from last time, what we tackled... What do I think? We tackled... Uh, <laughs> um, the... Uh, oh, what's his name? The Pack Bearer of Pride. Don't know what the next pack bearer is, but we're going to try and go after the first idea of that next pack bearer, and then call that a video. <laughs> Jesus. You did awesome out there. No one's blocking the way anymore, so you should be able to come and go from the building now. Sure, I hope so. I did hear there was mist in the first year, second year, and club buildings though. Mm, okay. I wonder if there are packed bearers in each of them too, like how Kurama was in this one. Well, uh, may as well give it a shot, huh? Uh, what are you uh and bad? Everyone's got their hands full dealing with the aftermath of Karama's actions. You yep. really do want to stay by your side, Vice President. But I'm needed here right now. Alright. Sorry about this. No worries, anytime. Don't put oh. yourself in too much danger, okay? I don't intend to. If you run into any trouble, you can come talk to me. I'll help you however I can, no matter what you need. I'm Australian. We're pretty self-sufficient on our own. We can take care. Of us. We can take care of ourselves. We don't need hand-holding. Where are we going? Oh Christ! What the hell was that? Oh my brain! Well, that's what happens when you have rocks in your brain and not fucking, not actually any brain matter. What we got here? Hey. Oh, we're doing a thing again? Okay, here we go. Well, hello there. Long time no see. What do you want, Sora? Dean Jingu. Who is the blue one, like? You forgot my name? How terribly, terribly rude of you. And I don't give a care, so. Uh. I suppose I'm also at fault for looking like her. Okay, what do you truly look like then? I really should get a makeover one of these days. Who the hell are you? I'm Yoru. You remember me, don't you? Not really. Wonderful. What do you mean you remember? For fuck's sake. Was no, she the one who tried to kill us in the beginning? You. Oh, great. Why, pray tell, are you trying to defeat the Pact Bearers? Because they're pain in the ass and I hate them. Someone needs to teach them a lesson. Oh, fascinating. May that be the pack bearer of Betty. Corrupt, do you? But what if some are kind and caring? Then fuck them. The more suffering, the better. You should know that there are seven other packed bears in this academy. What? Why don't you get to know them? Think long and hard about why you're doing this. Oh, okay. Now, the time has come. I may be able to give you an alternate solution. Okay, if what's... You want one, that is. Wait, there are... <laughs> and with that, I must say farewell. Wait, 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 what's this alternate solution? Is it multiple endings to this it's game? It's a premium, after all. Ta-da. Ta-da. Are you saying there are more playing this game? Okay. I suppose we'll see what's happening then. The fuck was that? Alright, let's continue me. Alright, well how are we exit the building? I'm assuming we go this way. Hey, nice. Ah. Uh. Oh, fuck, we're in the mist, aren't we? Well, let's go this way first to do this building first. May as well. Oh, okay, no mind then. Where the fuck am I going? Oh. Oh well, I 
okay, nice to know. Okay, so do I have a choice or do I not have a choice? No. Oh, is this, oh. West Street, here we go. Archives? No. So we won't go, is it? Where the fuck am I going? Map. I'm lost again. Ah. Uh, where the fuck am I? Current location, West. Where the fuck am I? Oh. Fuck is West Street? Fucking Jesus. Uh, wait. I, yep. No, I know where we are now. Okay. Here we go. Hey. What the fuck are people doing out here? Greetings, woman. That badge of yours. Your second year, correct? I guess. I'm not Japanese, I'm Australian. Is everyone in the second year building all right? Yeah, they are. Oh, I came from a different building. There you go, the main building. Oh, I see. I guess you wouldn't know how things are going inside then. Not That's particularly. Too bad. Why? Well, if you hear anything, please let me know. The what first is floor wrong? is covered in mist, so we can't just walk in and see for ourselves. I'll take care of it. First, let us save. No, that's not wrong. Save, here we go. Save the thing. There we go. And we will do two saves just in case we exit the save or not. Alright. Let us progress to the next building. Let us go off the first... Well, I don't even know what... Uh, what we're going on for. Very shiny walls. Uh. Fuck off! Ow! Can't. There you go. Picking on the week, huh? Not on my watch. Nice. Who the hell are you? Huh? Trying to fight these lame brains is gonna get you nowhere fast, you know? It's a guy with the scarf. <laughs> huh? Are you alright? We're fine. Of course I am. Ooh, that looks painful. Well, they attacked me first. Couldn't you have found a more pacifistic way to settle this? And they were you controlled by the witch. Too much credit here. Besides, you can't spell pacifist without fist. Exactly. He's not wrong about that. You want peace? You gotta fight for it. Uh, exactly. <sighs> That's just something my gramps used to say, though. Mm -hmm. He's not wrong, though. You just leave these kids to me. I'll take care of them. They're all yours. I didn't rough them up too badly, but I'll rest a little easier if you've got them, Dr. Neko. Yes, yes. Leave it to old Dr. Shiro Neko. The fuck? So, never seen you around before. I've never seen you around before. Nah, not that I care either way. Neither do Scram. I. Scram. You'll get hurt hanging around here. No, I don't intend to. Uh, 
have it your way. You want to go inside that bag? Fine. I'll show you around. Why are you helping me? Huh? Okay, what the hell is this? Jesus. Interference? From another authority? Uh, yeah, sorry about that. That was my authority. Hey, you a pact bearer? Oh, uh, yeah, how'd you know? Uh, that's right. Thought so. You're a lot stronger than you look. My power didn't do a damn thing to you. I'm Rio Taro Date, the pact bearer of gluttony. Great, I'm a pact bearer What's of vanity. Why are you here? To kill... To get rid of the ideals. <laughs> so, you're the vice president of the TSC, huh? It's just a stupid thing we came up with. All right, I get it. You want to defeat the other pack bearers and turn everything back to normal. Basically. You be the real deal if you manage to take down Karama. No, Karama? Yeah. He was always bugging me to team up with him. His grand scheme didn't jive with me. So I beat him to a pulp. Nice. I went out of this academy as much as the rest of you. But the thing is, I can't afford to lose my authority. Why? If we don't see eye to eye, we're gonna have to fight it out sometime or another. Why can't you afford to lose your authority? Not, not right now. Why? There's this weird disease going around the second year building. Oh, uh, okay, so you're trying to... That's why you're... says it's someone's authority. Don't know why. But some pack bears bent on making everybody in there suffer. Grinds my gears just thinking about it. Is your pa using your pack bear to protect people? Who's behind all this and beat the crap out of them? I agree with you. I can take you on after that if you want. Huh. Actually, team up. I got the idea. So I might go a lot faster if you help out. You catch my drift. I agree. Become companions. I think Gramps had a saying for this. Keep your enemies close and your nemesis closer. Basically. Oh, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Mr. VP. Act one. Ryotaro Date. Okay. Ooh, what a nice one. Well, there's a video title of the video already. So, <laughs> I'd love to get this manhunt started right away. What's keeping you? Oh, the ideals. But let's exchange some info first. Okay. How do you manage to take down a pack bearer? With help. The ideals. Okay. So breaking these ideal things voids the pact. And the way you find them is by getting calls in the mist. Basically, don't know how I'm getting calls in the mist since there's no bloody reception. The mist no, I've been trying to get Wi Fi on this damn thing for years. Do you have the Wi Fi password? Of whatever pack bear is causing this bug. Let's hurry up and investigate the mist so we can waste that asshole. Sounds good to me. GTA 5 style. Hey. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, yeah, the entrance was right here. My bad. You bloody idiot. All right, let's begin. We shall start with the second year building. It's spooky, isn't it? Don't like the sound of that at all. Alright, let us begin. Let's see what's coming there. Get in here. Oh, yep, we're starting to get mad. 
Alright, so we got another Cromwell, whatever it's called. Distortions or whatever it's called. Where the hell it is? Oh, I suppose we could go sick and fall then. Alright. Oh, bugger, what happened the hell happened to these poor blokes? And fellas, and ladies. That's pretty much how it looks. They're griping and groaning in pain, but physically, there's nothing wrong with them. Oh, uh, okay. And the only ones getting sick are the students in this building. Huh. But that's not all. I can feel a trace of someone's authority coming from them. Okay. A trace. My ability is called Hostile Takeover. It lets me steal power Fuck from the Android TV. Oh, that's pretty cool. What I feel from the people in this building reminds me of what I took from Karama. What? It's twisted. The kind of feeling you can only get from an authority. Yeah. It's not all that strong, though. Probably wouldn't affect anybody with some resistance to authorities, like us pack bearers. Probably. Uh, oh, why is that? Let me see. Life is just a series of doubts and worries. Hey, you, why not Tara taking a psychology test? Never had to reflect on yourself. All you have to do is answer this question. You're currently on the phone. What is your free hand doing? Jerking off! Naturally! <laughs> Fucking jerking off! <laughs> nah. Uh. Normally, my phone's in my pocket. This question test how vulnerable is a person. Answering your hand, answering that your hand's in your pocket makes you about 10% vulnerable. Your free hand represents your weariness, so if it's in your pocket, you might be a type to keep your cards close to your chest. Some would say that you aren't very open at all. Well, I try to stay away from strangers if I can, so I suppose that's true. Your ego. Ego is a special set exclusive to the protagonist. Aside from increasing greatly based on your answers during the various assessments given throughout the story, it can also be increased by defeating fiends or the corresponding sin, as well as through a psychology test. You'll be able to command fiends that correspond to the stronger aspects of your ego. Dep developing your ego like restrictions on what vessels fiends can equip, as well as let you acquire questions on alter egos. Got it. If we're going to be trapped here for eternity, then we've got to stick to that just two of us. Just to us forever? Yeah, till death do us part. Oh, show him, I'm so happy your person in tears. Uh, that fact thing I just did. And my side there is actually hurting. Uh, are you okay, Nana? Whatever. Uh, what the heck? Uh, I, you turn off all the oxygen in here. So you can't turn off oxygen. Everyone's gone as the mist and not a single one of them's come back out. I'm shaking my boots, but I have to go looking for them. Don't be an idiot. Is. Mr. Tsumabuki, it hurts so much. Oh, what a pitiful, pitiful sight. Ah, a oh, priest, by the humanity. Looks the world and God. Oh, great, so a cold. church. Fanatic. Jesus, that's creepy. Hey, well, we got the pack bearer. Okay. And you are? Your mom. That's who I am. I don't recognize you. But judging by your badge, you appear to be a second year. Yep. Just can say that. Be wary. This building is cursed. No, I know you're your pet bear. I can tell already. It's been like this since these anomalies began appearing in the academy. Sure. My precious students, one after another. Oh. You fool. Oh, bugger. 
Just what did we... What did they do to deserve this? Exactly, what did they do to deserve this? It's madness. It must be a curse. Or some form of divine punishment. Oh, for fuck's sake, enough. All we can do... Is pray. Fuck off. A curse? Divine punishment? What a load of bull. Exactly. Let's get going, Mr. VP. Sticking around here ain't gonna do us much good. Exactly. I don't want you to listen to a bloody it fanatic. It hurts. Help me. Shut up. Stop complaining. We've got things to do. You poor sword. <laughs> Keep it moving. Oh, right. I will. There's nothing we can do from now anyway. Not until. Why? Real horror. How can you be so? Uh, dude, you're kind of in our way. Yeah, so get out of our way. Your friends are suffering right before your eyes. How can you pass them by so callously? Haven't you the heart to care for others? Friends? I don't even know their names. How are they my friends? How? What a pity. You were such a good, honest child. How did you become so rotten? What would your late grandfather say if he could see you now? Not much. He wouldn't care about small-time shit like this. Basically. Just leave me alone, Mr. Tsumabuki. I will not. Your grandfather and I were close friends. What's that got to do with me? So, if you're not going to leave me alone, then what are you going to do? I shall pray. Oh, for fuck's sake. What? I shall pray for you to find your once kind heart. For your sins to be forgiven. For your continued safety within this accursed school. I shall pray. Even if the only prayers you receive are mine. What a load of crock. Cock, I would have said. Prayers can't save people. <laughs> Wait! Out of the way. I mean, you didn't have to push him out of the way. Fuck's sake, you might be the pack bearer, but I mean, come on, he's an old man. Ryotaro, that bastard! How could he do that to Mr. Tsumabuki? Hasn't Mr. Tsumabuki suffered enough? I can't believe he'd hurt an old man. That guy's the lowest of the low. <laughs> What? Nothing. I was just thinking. You guys are all sick in more ways than one. There's a staircase further down the hall. We can get to the first floor from there. Fine. Let's get going, Mr. VP. Yep. What now? Oh, right. Wrong way. Oh my god, you've got the worst sense of direction. Jesus. Fucking already up to bloody... Oh, we haven't even bloody... Oh no, I did start recording for an hour, so we've got a bit of time left. Find the first ideal and then I'll end the video, so fucking hell. Mr. Tsumabuki was a friend of my gramps. Can't imagine, he said that. I met him a couple of times when I was a kid. Yep. Pretty sure he was the dean of some other academy back then. He was kind of famous as an educator. I think the government even gave him an award or something. My gramps never shut up about how great he was. And from what I could tell, he was right. 
but about five years ago, Mr. Tsumabuki got sick and quit his old job. Even to the day my gramps died, he was worried about the guy. I remember it pretty well. Then two years ago, Mr. Tsumabuki came out of nowhere and showed up here. He seems different from what I remember, though. Real talk, I think the guy's gone senile. I mean, praying? In the middle of all this? If you've got time to pray, you've got the time to fix the problem yourself. Much Basically. better to take action than sit around crying. You'd have to be pretty messed up yourself to put a guy like that on a pedestal. Mm -hmm. Leaving things up to someone else is the same as ditching your own free will. Without it, Basically. what's the point in anything? That's no way to live, if you ask me. Life's about proving your worth, after all. Leaving your mark on the world. Basically. Oh, hello. It seems this place, too, is linked to the depths. <laughs> what is it? Oh, hey, Daniel. How you going? Off. Uh, let's see what we got here. Well, the Cromwell. Oh. I try really hard to find the flowers. What's his name? Blah blah blah. blah. Rest in peace. Cheer. Okay, Q, okay, well, okay, so that's her. There's no way, other way, we need to become normal again. Then our salvation will come. Has to. I'm not fucking answering it. I know what's in it. In spirit. Hey, you. Don't come any closer. Why? Hey, you. Did you wonder? It's dangerous past here. Stop lying. Huh? I'm not lying. Huh? I. Keep pressing. Assistant, aren't you? Cut the. You are. This is annoying as hell. Should have just listened and gone to the. Thank you. Well, here we go. The first ideal. That's the first one. That rock over there, one of those ideal things you were talking about? Yep. Looks like a piece of cheap jewelry. No wonder they break so easily. Mm-hmm. Where did you form Pact Retire? I've got a wish I need to fulfill. And I want to prove my worth, too. Mm. Gotta have power to do both. That's why I made a pact with the Monarch of Gluttony. It's not that complicated. Whatever. Oh, you know what? Now that I think about it, I haven't had a dream about Yoru since the anomaly started either. Oh, yeah. You've met her, right? Mr. V. Karama mentioned having a similar dream himself. Hmm. Dream like that would too. Thought so. I bet all the pack bears had one. Probably. Wonder what she's after. I don't think I want to find out. Anyway, we got company. All right, let's get to work. Oh wow, check it out, he's got pistols. This stuff is my magic gear, right? Yep. The Monarch of Gluttony gave me the rundown. You never fought before? Those guns. Yeah. You surprised? They're pretty rare in Japan. Don't worry about my aim, though. My gramps beat the basics into my head. I won't screw anything up. Good. Let's focus on this. Placement. Oh wow. Well. Then 
There we go. Perfect. Is that a pedal? Alright. Let's go, Rio Taro. It's losing time. Finally. Here I go. Uh, let's go here. Oh, we can attack food. Let's go. Oh, it's resonance. Uh, oh, it's yeah, so you're open. Ah, fucking miss, damn it. Oh, that hurt. Here I come. Can you fire? Shoot. Nice. My thoughts exactly. Oh right, wrath. How enticing. Oh right, you've got a nice. You got a crossbow. Uh, then wait. It's all mine. Say no. Ah, shit, friendly fire. Oh, I didn't realize you could destroy the. Oh, yeah, that's not good. Mm, what the hell? Oh, bleeding, is it? Here I go. Alright, let's do that. Fuck. Ow. Yep, taking a bit of damage here. I thought we fucking hell, Jesus. Mm. Okay, we got a heal. Mm. Not good. No, what the fuck? Oh, Christ. I miss fucking clicked. Don't fuck me up this time, controller. How's this? Uh, Slaughter them. Oh, good. No, that's Heal. I owe you. Thank you, my loyal servant. Ow, not good. Try that. Do a lot of damage, I mean, it's great, but I mean, fucking hell. Ah, we're not gonna win this! I can already tell! There's no way! Ah! Yeah, this ain't going well at all. Fuck. We've got to damage them. No mercy. We've got just at least to beat one. Ow. Here I come. Hmm. Rotaro, could you please heal me? I need to be healed. Not that I have enough. No! Why? Oh, I haven't played this in a long time. This is fucking ridiculous. I'm sorry. We got this. We'll try. I don't know how I'm going to win this, but we'll try. Oh. 
Christ. My lord. <laughs> We're not gonna win this, are we? Uh, why'd I heal you? You could easily heal yourself. Fuck! At least you don't fucking move. Oh, fuck! Uh. And bleed. Fuck, we got bleed, we got bleed, we got bleed. Alright, alright. You don't say. And I got no way to fucking heal myself. Fuck! Shit, alright. If I get defeated, I get defeated. I see what. I hope I can still use the other. Ah, uh, fucking. Fuck! Oh! Thank fuck! Okay, we might actually win this. Ow. Ow. No, I can't switch targets. Got it. No, we want static strike. Activate. That did jack all damage, but anyway. Fuck. As you wish, my lord. Hang in there, Sench Lust. Don't worry. Fucking hell. Oh, right. She's on yourself. Well, your mad gauge something go up pretty high, somewhat. It's all mine. How irritating. Oh, okay, we got to defeat this guy quickly. Yeah, I'm gone. It was nice knowing you, boys. What? Oh, what? What the fuck? No! Oh, okay. Ah! Fuck! Okay, so when you're defeated... Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay, that didn't go well. Uh, maybe we should wait here until they get to us. Oh, resonate. 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 Here I think I you're go. meant to fire from a distance. Hang on. What's your authority? Round shot. Fuck. I don't want to... Fine. Nice. Why is your mad gay so fucking high? Uh, wait. I hope I still got my fucking healing items. Good, I do. Four on the song, good. Uh... Go with that one. Uh, oh, fuck, are you serious? Can't reach it. Alright, what about. After. Fuck! Ah! I don't know, we're gonna win this! Fuck! Oh, let's go quick, please. I just wanna get this over with. Mmm, there goes a bleeding. Yep, that fucking hurt. Nice, ow. And keep going. Fucking move, damn it. Great. I can just reach him good. I like the voices of my bloody guys. It's like, it's fucking awesome. Nice, you got him, dude. Did they go? No, I didn't. Okay. Can't say no. No, no. Oh, she's playing right. Still not very happy, but I mean, well, what can I say? Uh, we're actually gonna hit him with the throwing knife because I do not want to <sighs> take any chances. Nice. Nice. Ow, bleeding. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna have to heal in a second. That's why it's a lot harder without what's his name? 
Use another rat shot. Nice. Ow. Alright, we're gonna... Oh, wait, you're not too bad on health. Give him the good old clay, buddy. And then we only need one more shot from last. Nice. That's him down. Alright. We got three more left to go. How irritating. Alright. Ow! Oh. You know me. Right. I need to heal. Actually. Yeah, no, I need to heal. I'm not taking any chances. On day five, I'm better off healing. We need to craft. We need to get more of those. So I'm gonna go back to the infirmary and do it afterwards. Uh, you're fine for now. I think. Resolve. I'll be my own man. Slaughter them. All right. You can't even from here, can you? Um. You're not really. No. Okay. Never mind. Wait for me. You'll be one of our frontline fighters. How enticing. Well, I can't move by you. Fuck! Okay, uh, well. Basically, wait. They'll let them come to us. Well, except this guy. We have to go in, but I mean. Not a totally bad thing. Mm, we gotta take him out of SAP. Right. I shall use a throwing knife. You're open. Not half bad. You need to shoot him. Ah, uh, wait, wait, wait. No, sorry, red shot. <sighs> you kidding me? Oh, yeah, there you go. Bang, bang. You need to block entrance to that so that we cannot get killed easily. Because these guys are a bit. That's why I set up in flames. Fuck you, you're just out of reach. And yes, you're out of reach again. Alright, so for now. Hide behind you. Because I do not want to lose you, especially because you are pretty powerful. Right, not good. Uh, we need, I need him to stay alive. Uh, nice, alright. Need a healing agent on you. So your max health again. I need you to ultra therapy yourself. Yeah, you're getting a bit high on bloody madness, so I might have to just. I don't know what happens when you get high on madness, so I might just. Oh, he's coming back, see. All right. Well, while he's re we are gonna do is throw a throwing knife at him. Get him down. Sound rage. I can't shoot behind there, can I? No, I can't. Fuck, I got him one. Uh. Oh, wait here. Alright. Okay, I like how their voice changes when they're high up on madness. Alright, he's getting sick. Alright, so he's starting to get really mad, isn't he? Uh, we'll pull back a tad bit because I don't want to get hit by the other guy. You're open. Nice. Here I come. All right, can you fire at him now? Ah, just had rage, right? All right, then the cat case gives us a resolve. Let's make sure you can block his entrance so you can't get to us. That's not right, never mind. Uh, wait. It's all my You're open. Nice. The madness. Right. Now it's just this guy. It should be simple enough. It's all mine. Oh, that's. 
smiles to their faces. It was I who brought joy to their lives, even though it was I who deserved it most. Why is it I who suffer so? Why is it I who wallows in anguish? They are unworthy, yet happy, while I am worthy, yet miserable. This world is unjust. This must be a mistake. If I must remain in misery, then they should be even more miserable than I. Oh. The vexation. Okay, I think I know what Trey, I think I know what scene it is. I think it's Envy. I think. I think it's Envy. The hell was that? Collection. The pack bearers will. Must be one jealous will. Probably yeah. means the sin is envy, huh? Yeah, I thought so. It's envy. <laughs> what a lame ass pack bearer. Yeah, I'd say. I'd never see eye to eye with someone like that. Yeah. Sounds like this envious person is suffering from a bit of depression. All right, first floor is cleared. Yo. Yo. What? Real Taro? Been a while, Prez. Well, Vice President, I see you're letting in just about anybody now. Hey, you help me. Hey, what the hell is this? I thought you guys were the true student council. This place is a dump. You don't say. So this is that view, Taro, huh? Meaning? He's practically an academy legend. What do you mean? Actually, because he's one of the heirs to the Date group. And because he brought in a nude model for art class. Oh, for fuck's because sake. Because he got separated during a field trip and ended up touring all of Japan before returning. Fuck off, he did. And because the Academy added multiple pages to the school handbook specifically because of him. He's made quite a name for himself. During the last school entrance ceremony, 
He vanished abroad for an entire year. He didn't even tell his family. He only just got back. I think he told you a whole bunch of shit to you. That gap year he took is the reason he's in your grade. But he should actually be in Nozomi's. Yes, he should. His disappearance sent the entire academy into an uproar. So, Ryotaro, why have you come to the TSC? Me and Mr. VP are partners now. Just until we take down this pesky little pack bear. That's all. Excuse me? How do you know about the Pact Bears in the first place? He's a Pact Bear himself. Because I'm the Pact Bearer of Gluttony. Duh. Duh, it should be nice by now. You? A Pact Bearer? I think I need to sit down. <laughs> <laughs> so your current comrade is a derelict drifter of a delinquent. And here comes the roaming rabbit again. Where's that voice coming from? My monarch. You've given another pact bearer your clearance. It should be no trouble to make my appearance. Say hello to Vanitas, my monarch. <laughs> Such a feisty, fearless fellow. And your roaming is really serious game. For I am Vanitas, a mighty being born of the abyss. And you, human, are irresistibly interesting. Intriguing, in fact. Devote yourself dutifully to my dominion, and I may be fain to furnish a few favors. This a stuffed animal or something? <laughs> no way. Is this thing a demon? Eh, not like I care either way. The only will I follow is my own. Yeah. You try, Vanitas. It was worth a try. It would seem, VP, that you have quite a knack for bringing these utterly deranged people back. You want to say that again? I'm going to grab you by the ears again if you... Yep, yeah, also. Ah! I, I, I did, I did grab by the ears. It was this guy. Was this oh, boy. Fur? That's some swanky shit. <laughs> Ryotaro, humor me for a moment. Has the Vice President explained how dangerous using your authority can be? Not really, I use mine all the time. Yeah. <laughs> and? So and? what? So what? It's capable of distorting the very fabric of our reality, that's what. It can't be that big a deal. I mean, it's nothing compared to a weapon of mass destruction. I ain't planning on giving it up for anything. And I ain't gonna let you guys take me out either. I've got plans for this power. We're teaming up because it's convenient. But if any of you get in my way after this, we just might end up on opposite sides. I have a feeling that he's not gonna just... No, uh, we're not gonna be outside. He's the companion for fuck's sake. Why would he be? You've known uh, Mr. Tsumabuki for a while. Right, Ryotaro? One thing I better do quickly. <laughs> Ryotaro's kind of an oddball. But I don't think he's a bad guy. He's not really a bad guy. It's just, well, he's, he's one of those anti-heroes, I suppose. Him, By the way, I heard that Dr. Shiro... You've already met her, right? You think so? What? Dr. Shironeko is a saint! How could you not recognize that? Because people sometimes call me a demon because I'm left-handed. She's beautiful. Well, I team worship more. You don't see a combination like that every day. Though, there are some rumors about her. I hear she likes to drink and that she has terrible luck with men. What, a woman of her attractiveness? I'd highly doubt it. That's probably because she's just an anime art star, that's probably why. <laughs> of the information humans analyze, 
They say 80% is derived from the eyes. I'll reveal the desires with which you... Question one. Which entity would you select from these two? If both claim they'll make all your wishes come true. Fucking an angel, not for you. Fuck the Question demons. Question two. Designate the dragon you deem most desirable. That one. Question three. Would you prefer Hera, Austere, and Spruce? Or Moon Goddess Artemis, daughter of Zeus? Well, I like to think one of my OCs, which is Amelia, I like I like to call her the goddess of uh the goddess well in my own little world i like to call her the goddess of the moon the elven goddess of the moon my own little world so i'm gonna go up the moon goddess artemis question four on one person's mind is a mathematics test the other a dream from their last night's rest from out of these two which does it seem is the one remembering their dream well they both got their eyes open i would have no idea uh, I was think this Question one. Question five. You catch your partner cheating on you. In what way would you look at the two? Uh, I would say I'll be disappointed and a bit cranky, but I'll say bread. Question six. You go to an all-you-can-eat buffet. Which set of food do you put on your tray? I'm fucking Australian. What do you guys think? Fucking steak. Question seven. Pick the picture you prefer. Naturally, natural adult, tiger and such habitat. Fucking forest. Question I like forest. Eight. You're instructed in art class to draw up a tree. Which one is closer to your mental imagery? Well, since this is close to a gum tree and wall tree, I'll go with this one. These questions were drafted with envy in mind, but it oh. seems that is not where your wants are aligned. Your desire for pride, though, is substantially high. So perhaps self-assertion is where your thoughts lie. Okay. It may be your high self-esteem grants reprieve from taking much stock in what others achieve. But envying others and jealous desire can just as well stoke one's inner fire. Your innate need for growth and self-affirmation would make such a fire its own compensation. What desires you follow are all up to you. Be true to your ego, as you already do. Okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So, I heard from Madam Prez that you got amnesia. A Does bit. losing your memory change your personality too? Right. Guess there's no point in asking if you wouldn't remember. But speaking of personality changes, Mr. Tsumabuki was a normal old man before. What could have made him change so much? I wouldn't I don't want think to end I'm... up like him when I get old. All shriveled and spineless. We all get old eventually. <laughs> Great. Oh, right. I can... Alright, that's enough of that. I hope we're not using our spirit for that. Don't put yourself in too much danger, okay? Right, we are going to go to the infirmary. I need to cure this fucking madness. Oh, what we got to eat? Yo. Yo. Hey, Dr. Kakeru. Damn, that's one messy desk. Dr. Nako was complaining about it earlier, but this is way worse than what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ryotaro. What? This desk is as clean as ever right now. And you're proud of that, old man? That's young man to you. Hmm. Hey, Vice Prez, how'd you manage to back this character? Uh, I long hate story. To break it to you, but even I can't cure a total lack of direction. I thought so. A lack of direction. Wait, you don't know how bad it is? Oh, mm. right. You've got memory loss. Probably better that way in this case. <laughs> Sorry guys, be a quarter and quarter, but I literally just started again, so we should be right. I never get lost. 
Wait, you never noticed? Noticed what? I'm just stating facts. Yeah, maybe I take some detours, but I always get where I'm going. Eventually. <laughs> detours. So that time you vanished during that field trip was just one big month-long detour? When you <laughs> finally returned to the Academy, you brought a whole truckload of souvenirs with you. Literally. Man, that takes me back. I think I got the teacher some Ryukyu and pottery. Pottery? All you gave me was a creepy wooden doll. <laughs> That's a Nipopo. I got it when I stopped by Hokkaido on the way back from the school camping trip. Man, <laughs> good memories. Hitchhiking, meeting different people wherever I went, it helped me learn that it's possible to get by, even if you're flat broke. You're a good kid, Vice Prez. And good kids don't want to grow up like him. Got it? So, why are you two running around together? You already know about the other world and pack bears and shit, right? I'm the pack bear of gluttony. <sighs> don't get me wrong. I don't really see eye to eye with these TSC people. But the pack bear in the second year building is a real piece of work. Until that clears up, we're in a ceasefire. The second year building? Isn't Dr. Shironeko there? Is she okay? Yeah, she's fine. Running around, healthy as ever. That's good to hear. Make sure Dr. Shironeko stays safe, all right? That goes for both of you. I can't slack off if she never comes back. <sighs> How'd you manage to trick the Academy into hiring a sleazebag like you to take care of us? Don't worry about it. I'm the kind of guy who knows when and where to be. I can handle things just fine if I put my mind to it. Oh yeah? I'll believe that when I see it. Yep. <laughs> Maybe you will someday. Anyway, I take it you're here for a checkup. Yes. Finally. Two guys, huh? Nah. I'll still do my job. What, you looking for a fucking female, you creep? Fucking idiot. That's just stupid. I need my man just cured. You seem kind of pale. You're good to go. Here's some medicine. Oh, Don't nice. push yourself. There we go. We're all cured and ready nice to go. The academy's getting safer. No, he's gonna go on a Facebook quickly. You know, just do a journal entry. You know, just save. All right, people. I think that we'll call it for tonight. The stray videos are finally up. I will get Tuesday's videos ready tonight. But for now, I shall see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. Love you all.